It's October 22. Let's talk about UK chicken quarter pounders. Bird's eye, the best I can see for two is £1.19 out of home bargains, which is a bit of a bargain when I compare it to the other shops. Aldi have their own range of their roosters, and two quarter pounders come in at £1.25 at the moment, October 22. Yeah, if you buy bird's eye, I think the only place, chicken quarter pounders, the only place to go is uh, home bargains and take the whole lot. Because at £1.19, I think in Asda at the moment, it's £1.50. And uh, I think Morrison's has them. On trolley.uk, uh, Morrison's is listed at £2.19. So I don't know, if, maybe that means four, but it's listed in the two uh, bracket, so... Uh, I mean, that's even dearer than Waitrose, who are like £1.80 or something. But the nearest to £1.19 is £1.50 out of Asda. Or you can get five packets for... No, four packets for £5, which works out at £1.25. There's been a recent price history in home bargains here. I think i done a video a few months ago where it was £1.19. Then I went in the next time it was like... Or was it was a £1.25, then I think it actually went up to £1.50 or something, but it's back down to £1.19, and I don't really know what's going on there, maybe uh, maybe Bird's Eye weren't letting them sell it at that price, but now they've changed their minds or something, but it looks like Home Bargains is a place to go, I mean, compared to Morrison's, if Trolley.uk is correct, you're saving a pound per purchase. As for taste, I can't really notice a difference. I mean, another thing about price, a few weeks ago this was a pound, then it went up to £1.25, I think. Is that what it is now? Yeah, it is. So, a few weeks ago that was the cheapest. Now, Home Bargains is the cheapest again, because they, they, their price went up for this, and then went back down. As for taste, I can't really notice a taste, but um, I don't know if they're, it's actually the same, you know, the same burger. I don't think so, actually, but I know that it was common uh, recently, or maybe even it still happens, where something like a brand who's got a big, massive factory, they would actually make the in-house ones for for the supermarkets, you know, like, uh, like roosters here. I mean, it makes economic sense, but then maybe they, they change the recipe a bit, I don't know, but, you know. So I don't know if they're getting made in the same place or whatever, but they both taste pretty good to me. Do they look the same? I don't know, really. Oh, what one's what now? The top one was bird's eye, wasn't it? I mean, they're sort of... The rice popsicle things. That one looks a bit smaller, but yeah, I don't know really. I'll leave you to decide. Yeah, when I turn them over, they look, they look very similar, don't they? Don't confuse them, guys. Remember which one's which. I wonder if they are a quarter pound, although I don't know what a quarter pound is, but first I'll try the Aldi. Coming in at 88 grams. Yeah, I'll try bird's eye. 105 grams. Hmm. They both say 227 grams for two, but I mean, it doesn't. I'm not bothered. Plus, it could be my scales, you know. Here's the Aldi brand statistics. Bird's eye statistics. Stats. Both of them have got 47% chicken breast. Apart from that, I don't really see anything that's going to make a big difference. You know, maybe, maybe the coating might have a different flavour, but I can't even see anything that might 
Might change the flavour. They've both got rapeseed oil, rice flour, wheat flour. They look very similar, although they're listed the other way around sometimes, but so who knows. I bought an air fryer, so I'm going to put them in that rather than my microwave. Great news, guys. My air fryer fits too. That one's bird's eye. That one's Aldi. Don't forget, you've got to have a system. Okay? This is the Asda Scoville. So, we fitted them both quite well. Everyone's gone air fryer crazy and so have I. Uh, I'm going to make it 10 minutes. Let's go. Looking at the nutritional values, I'm going per 100 grams here. It looks like bird's eye. It's got slightly more fat, just a bit. For 100 grams, it's 18%. And that one, it's 16%. I think I can notice that taste um, when I do. Now that they remind me. Everything else is pretty much the same. Bit more fibre in the Aldi one. One gram. Apart for that, look pretty similar. Three minutes to go. Let's take a look. Yeah, it looks all right, really. Um, one thing I find about chicken quarter pounders is uh, the middle. It takes quite often. I end up with the middle a bit soft. So I always misjudge that, even in the microwave, or do in the microwave, because the microwave is different. But in this, yeah, I do. I'll check it before it finishes. It's coming on nicely, but it's the middle that I'm bothered about. I should have flipped them round halfway, but I'm going to add another minute. Come on, come on, come on. I know you want to hear the beeps. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah. It does beep eventually once that fan goes off. I'll just check them now. Oh, that was a very beep there. Well, they look nice on the outside. It's uh, the middle. It's always the a big point in it. So that's bird's eye. That's Aldi. Yeah, the bird's eye looks a bit more cooked. Probably because it's got a bit more fat, maybe. I'm just speculating. Okay, system time. That's bird's eye, isn't it? Yeah, that's pretty hard. This is Aldi. Does that tell you anything? Is that useful information? I didn't plan on eating any, never mind eating two, I usually only have one, but okay, we'll do a, I'll split it in the middle so we can see what it's, what it's like in the middle. That looks pretty good to me. It looks good to go. You can't always tell though, because they may be white, but they may be a bit soft. Here's bird's eye. Well, they look okay to me. I'll taste in the middle. First, bird's eye. I would say it's 95% cooked. I feel there's just a bit in the mid middle. Just a bit soft, but it's nice. It was alright on both sides too. And it didn't. It didn't uh, burn on the outside, 
quite often when I use my air fryer I burn stuff not bad because I, I like it it's almost grilled but this didn't happen to us yep it's cooked it's nice okay I've taken a swig of iron brutic so it's a fair and balanced taste test so here goes with Aldi Yeah, I would say it was about 98% cooked as well. It's the same, really. They're both very, very similar. But I think I prefer the Aldi just, just slightly. It just seems there's a lesser oil taste. Yeah. Which in this case is nice. So, look at all that fat that came in there. Feels like I could have done with another minute or two of it. Or slightly higher, I don't know. I can only go up 5 degrees increments and that anyway they're both nice and uh, this is the cheapest if you get it out of home bargains at £1.19 that's one twenty five. but so there's only a six pence difference but most shops actually at £1.50 or even up to £2.19 for two so it depends where you're shopping if you're at home bargains you may as well take the whole stock <coughs> but uh, Possibly for taste, I prefer this, you know, but only slightly. I mean, I'm talking about one or two percent, maybe five percent. But they're both very tasty, you know, like nine out of ten, nine point five out of ten. So, it's you pay your money, you take your chances. It's October twenty-two, one pound nineteen for two in home bargains, but uh, one twenty-five in Aldi. They're both really good. Here's the. A snapshot of all we do a double or. for prices check dirly.co.uk it's all good that was fantastic I should add that the uh, home bargains aren't listed in trolley.uk from what I've seen so thanks to all the supermarkets that are listed there because it means we can compare prices but home bargains are often the cheapest of the lot, I find. Not always now, but certainly for this, uh, for Birdseye, chicken burgers in October 22. Like I say, uh, they were £1.19 around about March. Then I think they went up to one twenty five. Then, then I think they went, maybe went up to one fifty. I can't remember, but for a while it wasn't worth going to home bargains for uh, Birdseye quarter pounders but chicken quarter pounders but they're back in the game again with £1.19 for bird's eye but uh, I've just finished them both and I, I don't know they're both really good I think I sort of prefer that by maybe two two or three percent or something it just it feels a bit lighter you know the, the, the coating but uh, I could be delusional Hand it up when you're opening it. It says press the opener. See, you go like that. Then you do whatever. I don't know. That's the LD one's got it too. Mm, something like that, you know. You'll figure it out. 